welcome to Universal, everybody. Here's a quick look at uh, Sapphire Falls and the construction that's going on. Two new parking garages. Oh, they're like painted and everything. Yeah. Wow. So those are huge parking garages for a hotel, but it's also a conference center. So we're a little bit confused as to whether maybe that might be the parking also for Volcano Bay, which is over here behind these trees on the left. Um, I don't know. Man, I can't believe how fast this is going up. This is insane. Yeah. Check it out. So last time we were here, which I think was last weekend, they were just starting to put the windows in this far tower. I don't know if you would call it a tower, but unit over here. We're gonna kind of pass it when we come up around the corner here. Yeah. It's like right over here. Wow. So. Are those rooms? Those are rooms. Okay. And they were just starting to put the windows in this tower the last time that we were here. Now it's already got stuck on the outside and everything. Wow. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to stay there. Yeah. Do they have a sign for it? Oh no, that's Pacific. Okay. I was trying to uh, get into parking as quick as I could and I didn't get to show you guys, but there's new digital signage out in front of the parking booths. So that, I mean, I guess they could just change the parking price anytime they want to. Which is a good thing because on some days, not on Halloween Horror Nights days like tonight, but it'll change to $5 after 6 p.m. to park, which is nice. So NBC Grill Brew is all but open now. Like it is ready to open. They've been doing like uh, previews and stuff for VIPs. So yeah, this is one of the things that's holding them back from being open right now is the fact that they're still working on the Jumbotron. But everybody else, there's like, or everything else is good to go and they're doing, everything's working inside. They've been feeding VIPs and stuff the last few days. So any day now, really. We've heard Tuesday. Really wearing an appropriate shirt for this music. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's like a seeing eye dog up there or like a, a service dog. And it's a wolf, like straight up a wolf. <laughs> yeah, look at it. Yeah, you guys can't see it. Every once in a while, you might be able to see like its tail pop through. I mean, it's either a husky or a hybrid. Look at its little like funny wobble. I feel like I've never showed you guys all of the different games that you can play here during the day and at Horror Night. Stopped inside of Monsters Cafe to uh, get a quick bite to eat. Oh no, crazy. Um, I'm just gonna get like a little slice of pizza. Frankenstein's monster. Look at Svelte. Here's my pizza from Monstrous Cafe, and then we got specialty HHN uh, pumpkin beer, which is not bad. It's kind of pumpkin-y. Not as pumpkin-y as like a regular pumpkin beer. Walking back out into the park to head to our stay and scream area. It just started raining out there, and they're getting ready to release us. Oh dear. But it's like sun shower, which is strange. I don't even know if you guys can see the rain. There's a rainbow over Universal right now because it's raining. Just went through Freddy vs. Jason. It was good again. Uh, first half was a little bit slow, but then it picked way up at the end. Looks, oh, there was the opening ceremonies. Fireworks went off. Uh, it looks like they're doing some work on the fire effect. So we did stay in Scream and they just let everybody in for regular park entry. There should be a huge mass of people coming in right now. All right, park just opened. Freddy vs. Jason is now 25 minutes. Just did Jason, Freddy vs. Jason again. It was amazing, one more time. It was great. I would do it 10,000 times in a night. Body Collectors right now is just a 10 minute wait. Just did Body Collectors. There is never a time where I will not like, thank you so much, where I will not like Body Collectors. So just wanted to show this really quick. It says it's 55 on the app, but it's only a 10 minute wait here. Puppy dog. There are so many people in this scare zone right now.
at this sunset that's happening right now. Hopefully this storm doesn't come, but it might. We're going into run right now. Beautiful, plus right there, the disaster car. Run is fun, but it's definitely a totally different experience during the day. Uh, the chainsaw guys right there, still a lot of fun. Rest in peace, Disaster Studios. We are heading out to All Night Diane, and uh, it's looking like it's the color cast. So we've got the thing here, right? Looking scary. We got Chucky and Bride of Chucky. Uh-oh. And Carrie. Uh-oh. The Exorcist girl. Looking all scary. Chucky and Bride of Chucky. The vampires from Castle Vampire, I could think. Oh, a couple of guys from The Purge. Sorry, they're from Cirque du Freak, not Castle Vampire. The Castle Vampire ones are a bit more, how do you say, uh, scandalous. Look at that sunset. It's the only ride. It's beautiful. Sunset, sunset isn't actually over there. It's actually behind London here. But look at this. It's very nice. See, there's the actual sunset right there. That is so beautiful. All right, I'm gonna totally give you guys like the panoramic right here. Look at this, you ready? Here it comes, here it comes. Look at that. So beautiful. He has a bloody mouth. Getting ready to go into The Purge. Or no, we're getting ready to go on Walking Dead, but The Purge is 60 minutes. Walking Dead is also 60 minutes, so we're like kicking into Express. We are heading into The Walking Dead now through Express because it was a 60 minute wait. Look at that line over there. So we're gonna show you The Walking Dead uh, facade until they tell me to put the camera away. Oh look, they're like doing some farming out here. Very nice. It smells like chlorine out here already. Pretty intense. Walking Dead was, uh, was The Walking Dead. Same as it's always been. We're heading into the purge now. Still a 60 minute wait. All right, Horror Nights, take notes. I will not be upset with you guys if we walk around the corner and there's just a creepy guy up on the stage right there. Not doing anything, not scaring anybody. Just standing there, like, like in Psychoscarapy, waving that severed hand. That would be brilliant. He's the handsome straight, uh oh, it's purging time. Some sort of alarm going off in there. I'm hoping the handsome stranger is going to be out, but I don't think he's going this to be. Uh oh. Broadcast system. At the siren, all crime, including murder, would be legal for those who have been selected to purge. Those officials ranking 10 or higher must remain unharmed, and any usage of weaponry class 4 or higher is forbidden. It's an 80 minute wait for Insidious. Heading into Insidious, I will never get over this facade. It is so beautiful. I still think one day it was real windy out here and like the curtains were blowing around in there and it was awesome looking. It looked like scary like ghosts were in there but it was just the wind. People that are getting in behind us, we're in Express for Insidious, but the people that are getting in behind us are cheering because they made it. They're like, we made it. That is a full out house right there. And all the lights are on and ghosts are everywhere and they're scary. Now don't get me wrong. It is a very well done house. I just have never been scared in it. And I don't like that. I just uh, want to be scared. Time for some more clowns out in front of Springfield. Oh, she's walking backwards to make sure. It's so scary. So many clowns with chainsaws. Lots of people on stilts coming through. Thank you. 
your flash on. Don't do that. kind of a busy night tonight. We're heading into Monsters and Mayhem and it is a 55 minute wait. Scary tales going off right here. So as we're walking through the queue, there's a big wall here, but I wanted to show you guys. They're showing like a video that's like a, like a slideshow of years past. So, I don't know, there's like a little crazy man there with like a blue mask. Scary stuff. All these people riding uh, Rip Ride Rocket at night, which is a fun thing to do, by the way. But I would rather spend it, spend my time in the houses. Just walking out of Monsters and Mayhem right now. I love it. Such a good house. I love it. It's fantastic. Recommend this as one of the houses that you go through. It's the only other few that you can go through. <laughs> Oh, so close. No! Oh, hit it harder. Oh! Heading into American Werewolf. It was a 30 minute wait. Um, that's it over there. Pretty long wait. Pretty long wait. All of them that I've shown you guys have been over 30 minutes so far. Side note, you guys will have to excuse me if like during this video I look up at the screen a lot because I like to see what's going on behind me because there's always something happening at Horror Nights behind me and this screen makes it great for me to see it. Ah, the staple of Horror Nights, the bright light. New record for American Werewolf. I saw the wolf go after me once. All right, still no scares. You know, it's kind of hard to see, but there are a lot of characters back here. Oh. <laughs> by uh, Transmorphers. Heading into Alice, or Asylum in Wonderland right now, and it's 45 minute wait. 
Alice was good. They just added some extra stuff to it and it made it pretty darn awesome. So we've done all the houses. We're headed to Bill and Ted, but I want to show you guys run right now is a 70 minute wait. Totally gonna meet Bill and Ted right now. It's gonna be awesome. Bye guys. Oh, it's a video. Bye. <laughs> By the way, I forgot to show you guys the Simpsons thing is back. Finally. Remember how there was a big blue box here for the longest time? Since there's nobody in here, I kind of wanted to show you guys a little bit of what's going on in the Quickie Mart. You get like an Apu t-shirt. Simpsons minis. Oh, look at this Bartman one. That's awesome. I didn't really have that I know. Beer. Now there's a temporary solution. Are you ready to get duffed? <laughs> Oh, there's a lot of fun stuff in here. More Bartman stuff? Blinky? This is awesome. Phone cases and the such. Ooh, all of their Christmas stuff. Wow. It's like a little Christmas village. This is awesome. Oh, they've got like Simpsons Converse. That's pretty neat. Thank you. Come again. I am Groot. forums tomorrow because it's everybody's favorite game whack a troll maniacal laugh kiddies ah! soon you're gonna be puppet dying <laughs> let's see who's on first what's on second what about the short stuff i don't give a damn oh oh, <laughs> oh hello marcia <laughs> poor troll he seems to have lost Ooh. That's hot! You just missed that kill. Yeah, when I walked by, you were just... Simply madness in here. Madness! Because they were doing the kill, and so they wanted to break up the crowd real fast. So they just send in like a ton of chainsaws. 
That seems like an easy way to do it to me. So many people are just like hanging out. Walking past 25 years, a 45 minute wait. This is Bell. We did figure this out. And there's Beast. Totally had a good run through American Werewolf. Yes, that was awesome. One last trip through Scary Tales, and then we're heading out. Never seen the Wicked Witch before today, which is great. <laughs> Little Red Riding Hood, the big bad wolf. See you later, Universal Orlando. It's been a fun night. Man, these people like take wearing fresh Jordans to the new level. They're like, bought my Jordans, I'm wearing them tonight. Are they in there? Are there old ones in there? No. Oh. They're empty. That's weird. They bought the display model. Yeah, He's, I just will never get it. Like there's trash there, there's trash here. Trash can is literally right there. Like that's the trash can. And these people can't walk from here to there. We're back home and we had a fantastic night at Halloween Horror Nights tonight. We did all nine houses, both shows. And there's there's not much, and we saw all the scare zones and it was fantastic. We saw all the roaming hordes too. It was great, it was a great night. I had a good walk through uh, American Werewolf in London, had great walkthroughs of Jason versus Freddy, Freddy versus Jason, uh, Body Collectors, 25 Years of Fear. Oh, it was fantastic. So uh, we're off to bed though, because it's 1.30. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.